Praise God our Father for His greatness and mercy. Psalm 145 says, He will exalt you, my God the King. I will praise your name forever and ever. King David, a man after God's own heart, teaches us about the nature of our Heavenly Father. Here, David sets an example for us. He commits to a lifetime of praising God, not just in moments of joy, but in every circumstance. Every day is an opportunity to acknowledge the majesty of our Lord. Great is the Lord and most worthy of praise. His greatness no one can fathom. David reminds us of the unfathomable greatness of God. His greatness is beyond our understanding, yet we experience it in the wonders of creation, in the depth of His love, and in the miracles we witness every day. One generation commends your works to another. They tell of your mighty acts. This verse calls us to share the stories of God's greatness. Just as our forefathers passed down their experiences of God's faithfulness, we are entrusted with the responsibility to tell future generations of His mighty deeds. They speak of the glorious splendor of Your Majesty, and I will meditate on Your wonderful works. David shows us the importance of meditation. In our busy lives, let's find moments to pause and meditate on the splendor of God, allowing His Spirit to fill us with awe and gratitude. They tell of the power of your awesome works, and I will proclaim your great deeds. As we witness God's power in our lives and in the world, let's be bold in proclaiming His deeds. Our testimonies can be powerful tools in bringing others closer to Him. They celebrate your abundant goodness and joyfully sing of your righteousness. God's goodness is abundant and overflowing in our lives. Even in times of trial, His goodness remains. Let us be people who recognize this goodness and joyfully sing of it. The Lord is gracious and compassionate, slow to anger and rich in love. In this verse, we find the heart of God's character. He is not a distant, indifferent deity, but a loving Father, full of grace and compassion. As we reflect on these verses, let us be inspired to live a life of constant praise, meditate on His wonderful works, and joyfully share the stories of His greatness and mercy. Let's remember our God's gracious and compassionate nature, who is slow to anger and rich in love. Amen.